Hello, my name is Diksha and I work under the supervision of Professor P. Venkateshu here at Department of Chemistry, University of Delhi. Uh, I majorly work with antibody formulations. Uh, recently, our paper got published in AC Sustainable Chemistry and Engineering Letters. Uh, this work was in collaboration with uh, Dr. Masaram Lab. Uh, what we try to do is we try to study the interaction of metallic organic frameworks with hemoglobin. Uh, before jumping into the depth of the work, I would like to show you some of the pictures of our department. So here are the pictures. Metal organic frameworks, also known as MOVs, have shown tremendous application in drug delivery. Thus, ZIF-8, that is zeolite imidazole framework 8, and AUZIF-8, composite of ZIF-8, was synthesized and utilized to evaluate their bulk compatibility with hemoglobin. Coming to the preparation of ZIF-8 and AUZIF8 composites. 2-methyl imidazole solution was added in zinc acetate solution. Both the solution was stirred for 24 hours at room temperature and then centrifuged and dried. The obtained material was then sent for characterization. For the preparation of AUZIF8, the obtained material from the first procedure was added to gold solution and a reducing agent NADH4 and trisodium citrate was added. Again the solution obtained was centrifuged and dried and then again characterization of, this, uh, of the obtained material was done. Coming to the characterization, here are the uh, characterization of both the MOF particles. We did the XRD, FKR, uh, XPS as well as SEM, TEM of both the materials as ZIF8 and AUZIF8. Coming to the interaction of these metal organic frameworks with hemoglobin, both the materials interacted favorab favorably with the um, hemoglobin, that is, the conformation somehow was changed uh, from the native conformation. Uh, we studied. Uh, two parameters majorly, one is thermodynamic stability and other was colloidal stability. Coming to the colloidal stability, as from the graph, it can be seen that hydrodynamic size of pure protein was in between 100 to 100, whereas when added with MOF, the size tremendously increases. This increased size uh, shows the formation of a cluster of MOF with protein. Uh, as well as we also took the term images of hemoglobin with MOF. Coming to the thermodynamic stability, uh, we uh, did this experiment with thermal fluorescence and we studied the transition temperature of hemoglobin. Uh, for the native hemoglobin, the transition temperature was 67.6. Uh, when we added ZIF8, like 100 microliter, the, there was increment of 10 degrees Celsius in both the composites. However, as the concentration of the MOF was increasing, the thermodynamic stability decreases. So the trend is that at low concentration of MOF, the protein, the protein was stabilizing. So this was the all over, uh, like the crux of the work. Uh, we try to study the drug delivery, uh, like how the proteins are interacting with the MOFs, so we can use it in the application of drug delivery. Thank you. Mm -hmm.